Good evening. I'm Bogus Bogus with the Beagle Beagle uh, News. Tonight, bestiality in Birmingham as BJ bears up to his name. The famous former TV star was arrested today on animal sodomy charges. Sources say he was allegedly playing a game called Organ Grinder. President Carter announced tonight that negotiations to free the hostages in Iran have stalled. Quote, we offered them Farrah Fawcett, Ryan O'Neill, and Leif Garrett. However, they insisted on Christy McNichol, Wayne Newton, and two future draft choices. The Japanese auto industry suffered a severe blow yesterday when that famous nemesis of the deep, Godzilla, appeared for a rematch with yet another arch enemy, the mutant tomato. Several Trinitron, <coughs> several Trinitron televisions from a nearby Sony factory were evacuated as the conflict threatened to spread. As of news time, the fight was still raging. Coming up next, cows upside down after this. Some people just can't seem to run into what they need. But you'll find everything you need at self-service drugs. There's no waiting in line, no inconvenient prescriptions, no money. You just walk right in and help yourself. See the anonymous folks at self-service drugs, where you shop and we pick up the pieces. Professor That's William Costello doesn't, doesn't know, know our secret, secret self-service self camera, camera is focused on him. Therefore, probably all mammals have lungs. I go to self-service drugs and just take it. Free. I can't believe it. Yeah, you bet. Self-service drugs? <laughs> oh, you got to be kidding. It's the first stop on my shopping list. Never heard of it. The price is always right, but sometimes the selection is fantastic. <laughs> get it fast. Get as much as you want and get the hell out. But get it at Self-Service Drugs, your one-stop drug shop on the corner of First or Second. There appears to be a slight mix-up on that cow story in the control room. Actually, that was cows sideways. The Osmond clan has announced the engagement of Marie Osmond and Big Bird. The wedding of the two celebrities is planned to be held on Sesame Street with the Reverend Oscar the Grouch officiating. A Mormon ceremony is planned. Well, the MX nuclear missile program appears to have at least one proponent. A female Bigfoot has been seen stalking one of the missile sites recently. Authorities are still puzzled as to what she's up to. Today, the European Common Market In Iran, the Ayatollah Khomeini made a speech to a large crowd in Tehran. He had this to say. Well, everyone seems to have heard about the Cuban refugees in Florida, but an interesting statistic came up today. Since the refugees began arriving, there has been a 500% increase in Watergate-style burglaries. The Spaceball Playoffs next. You don't know him, but he knows you. He knows your problems, your needs. He knows. Because... He's been there. He's one of us. He eats. He reads. He watches interesting programs on television and does odd jobs around the home. But he's no home buddy. He's out there meeting people, walking, stumbling, and participating in FBI covert operations. I'm Doofus McSwindle, and I'm running for Montana State Senate. I've always felt that the person most suited for running an incompetent and uh, inefficient government is truly an incompetent individual. And he's out to prove it. He's a leader who never forgets that he goes where the people go. Whether he's out kissing babies and cooperating with local law enforcement officials or seeing the scenic outdoors, he's doing the kind of things that you and I here in western Montana do. He knows what we need and refuses to submit to extortion or blackmail. Yes, simplistic solutions to complex problems. That's the type of man we need. Doofus McSwindle, Republican for State Senate. Paid for by citizens for McSwindle, Daryl Harvey and Brad Walsh, chief instigators. In Spaceball action tonight, in the Quinby League, it was Pittsfield 24, Sheen 3. In a close game, it was Omengee 19, Lake 7, 
as star nickelback Cuzzy Foathanger was injured in the first period by Menstrual Man. Down in Florida, it was Hole Blue 69 Oxnard 2 and 2 thirds. A bunch of free swingers, those Hole Blue boys. <laughs> Over in the Wank League, in an important contest, it was the Badgers 90, Quasimodo 71. Trenchmouth really whomped on Carbuncle, 5-4, to four, eliminating the quits from per per further playoff action. And in a big upset, it was the Mutts over the Smuts with a surprising 91 to the Smuts 2. An investigation is pending concerning the outcome of the game. In the League of Women Voters, it was Mrs. Hag 4 to Mrs. Butterworth 1. That's a look at... That's a look at sports. In local news, local psychic Spacely Sprocket has predicted an earthquake in the Missoula area to coincide with this newscast. Have you ever heard of such bull? Oh, no. No. No, it's moving! It's over. Well, folks, you saw it here first, another Beagle exclusive. And finally, a local resident was accused today with possession of over 7,000 tons of cocaine. Authorities believe the drugs were smuggled into the country by a marching band returning from Tierra del Fuego. Released on bond was local newscaster Bogus Bogus. <laughs> That's fit for tonight. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> You don't know him, but he knows you. He knows your problems, your needs. He knows. Because he's been there. He's one of us. He eats, he reads, he watches interesting programs on television, and does odd jobs around the home. But he's no home buddy. He's out there meeting people, walking, stumbling, and participating in FBI covert operations. I'm Doofus McSwindle, and I'm running for Montana State Senate. I've always felt that the person most suited for running an incompetent and uh, inefficient government is truly an incompetent individual. And he's out to prove it. He's a leader who never forgets that he goes where the people go. Whether he's out kissing babies and cooperating with local law enforcement officials or seeing the scenic outdoors, he's doing the kind of things that you and I here in western Montana do. He knows what we need and refuses to submit to extortion or blackmail. Yes, simplistic solutions to complex problems. That's the type of man we need. Doofus McSwindle, Republican for State Senate. Paid for by citizens for McSwindle, Daryl Harvey and Brad Walsh, chief instigators.